Hey guys, it's Justin. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. And today we're staying at Disney World for four days at the Caribbean Beach Resort. Slugs are Taylor's favorite ones. She hates them. It's a red one or a purple one. I don't know what it is. The most magical place on earth. Got that on video there for you, Mom. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Here's where we're staying. We're about to pull into the Caribbean to pick up a ski. You can see this guy on the we're about out of Skyliner, so we can ride it to Hollywood Studios and Epcot. Here it goes. My mom does not like the Skyliners. Huh? We just got here. We left about 6 a.m. this morning. Um, this is my graduation present because we've never stayed at a moderate resort like that. Well, we stayed at one. It was the um, Coronado Springs, and I vlogged them way back when. But this one's really nice, and we're staying here for four days. We're going to Hollywood Studios today, then tomorrow's Epcot, then a chill day where we're going to Ohana, which is a really nice restaurant, and then the next day we're going to Magic Kingdom. So, I'm very excited. Oh, this looks so cool. Oh, the ceilings are high, man. Oh, it smells good in here. I'm so excited. Okay, I got. we gotta go check in. We just checked in to get our room. We're about to go. My mom's going to the bathroom, but here's the gift shop. Nice little... What? Oh yeah, that is my shirt. I'm wearing that Doha Han. I didn't really explain what Doha was. Huh? Oh wow. Those are cool. Oh, those are the electrical parade ones. Okay, I didn't realize. Oh. See, that's like kind of sad though, because like we don't have the electrical parade stuff. Oh look, Taylor. I want to buy this. The H2O plus sea salt. Does it smell like something? Waffles? Pretzels? No, it just smells like fabric. Probably everyone else is sitting there nose to it. Yeah, it does. Um, here's some H2O plus sea salt. This is Disney's like soap brand now. They only let you keep it if you're staying at the um, if you're staying at the uh, the deluxe resorts. They let you keep it. Otherwise, they lock it to the shower, so you can't take it. This is a ornament. Pretty cool. They have a lot of these that are like this. Ohana. Anyways, I didn't explain. Monday night we're going to Ohana. You want to explain what Ohana is too? Yeah, Polynesian food. All you can eat at the Polynesian Resort. And it's very nice. It's Ohana, you know, from Stitch. So we're really looking forward to it. I have, oh yeah, there's bucket hats. I didn't realize what you had. Here's a bunch of other hats. Monsters University up there. All right, we're leaving the gift shop now. We're, our room's kind of by, sorry, I just ran into you. I don't even know, where is it? What's the one's called, Taylor? We're in Barbados. Barbados. All of them are themed to like, I guess that's an island, I think. But, uh. There's the sign behind me. But now we can go get our room. So I'm looking forward. All right, we just come in now. Here's Matt. It's pretty tall ceilings. I thought it was going to be lower. We got a while for Matt. There's me. And this is like very tall. Like, it's to like my chest. There's the nice beds. I know, but there's like, I know, but there's like, it's just like a bar, so I know you can take this, I guess. Is that all you get? <laughs> they don't let you keep any of it. I mean, besides this. Oh, Look on the walls. Hold on. Where is the light? There we go. Here's the flower show. You know, see? They lock it in there so you can't take it. This is pretty cool. Here's the resort channel. Pretty neat. Bed's pretty comfortable. Now we can go to Hollywood Studios. Alright, Ma, here we go. Ready? Woo! It is very humid, yes. The walk to here was interesting. Alright, heading to Hollywood Studios. You excited? I gotta get, I have a little porg from. Oh, we're bumping. Swaying too. <laughs> Y'all love this. Okay, I look silly. I can see my thing. Anywho. There's my little porg sitting on my shoulder too. We got the whole Star Wars, I got ears on too. Uh, we're about to walk into Hollywood Studios now. 
everything's a really long wait, but it is a Saturday, which I just realized. So, like Mickey and Minnie's Runaway Railway is at 102. Sounds like fun. Okay, so we've decided against uh, going on a ride first. Uh, we're gonna go get lunch. It's like 2.30 by now. So, here we are, Hollow Studios. Grand old Hollow. I didn't ever realize that there was like little Pluto up there. That's cool. And then, yeah, so we're going to Pizza Rizzo to go eat lunch. Late lunch, I guess. So, I'm looking forward to it. It's hot. I don't know if I mentioned that earlier. It is freaking humid. So, oh, we're separating. We're pulling over, I guess, to go figure out what we're eating. Or where we're, I don't, what we're, I don't know how to describe it. Alright, we've ordered. Now we're heading, let's Holly, Hollywood and buy. This 50s, oh, 50s prime time, if you don't know what it is, I'll put pictures up. It's a 50s themed restaurant, like it looks like a kitchen, as you can see. We've been there before, it is so cool. They like treat you like, they're like your mom and stuff, like that's how you know elbows on the table, like put your phones away. Oh, there's chip in there. Taylor told me earlier, yeah. They, they walked away, they're there. Do what? Oh yeah. Can I yell? Should I yell hi Chip and Dale? I don't think they're gonna hear me. No, they're leaving, darn it. Yeah, we'll yell, we'll, we'll see them later. Here's uh, Indiana Jones. We've not been there in a very long time. They closed it for a while because of COVID, but now it's back open. Tell me why I didn't know this was an ice cream stand. I thought this was just a... It's not open all the time, but you have to like hit it just Oh. I had to put my little porg away because he fell off my shoulder while I was walking because my backpack's on, so he's just gonna stay away. But here's our Pizza Rizzo pizza. Matt, what did you get? Meat lover? That one. The guy tried to put all four of these on this one tray and they almost started to all fall, almost all started falling off. So we had to move it. But this looks really good. Okay, mom, mom's talking about someone's video. Alright, now we finished. Really good lunch, 10 out of 10. Now we're going to Star Tours, which my mom and Matt are not riding. Not a ten out of ten. Well, not okay, not ten. Out, okay, we'll say seven and a half out of ten. Good. What do you rate? We've eaten there before. I don't know why we're rating I it. A six point five. Like it's just pizza. Okay, Taylor. It's Anyways, like okay, Taylor. Okay, Taylor. Now we're going. To, <laughs> now we're going to Star Tours, and so mom and Matt don't ride it because it makes them nauseous. But we ride it, so we're going on it. Please. Right, so we were in line for Rise of the Resistance for over an hour, and then we decided to leave because we we looked up on the queue online for how long the queue was, and we had a long way to go. And it is currently 5.12 when we got in line at 3.40. Yeah. So, I think we're just going to go around in Star Wars Land and just like go to shops and stuff, and then we're going to go on like a few more rides because we don't got a night. Hopefully, like, we might get a swim tonight. The pool's open until, like, 10 at our hotel, so we might do that. Anyway, so, you know, we have some prizes, or not prizes, but things Surprises. in store. Surprises. Surprises in store for you. So, one is, uh, we got to tell you about now, because it might change the plans up a little bit. So, Taylor? It's not a lightsaber, sorry. Not. There was no reservation, but we got a reservation at Otis Cantina. That will even it up some. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Okay, she tried to record me. I guess I'll try and put it in here. I don't know if my face is in there. But she got a reservation for Ogus Cantina somehow. Uh, that was like a little surprise for like graduation. Taylor, I guess, wakes up early is what mom said and gets a, a reservation. I don't, I don't, I'm not signed in on the app of my phone. So I, it never like popped up and told me that we had it. It's like, you said what, 7? 7.50. So I'm really excited. We can go to Ogus. It's, really, it's a Star Wars like little like bar sit down area and it's got like space drinks and everything and there's like DJ Rex and everything playing in there really hard to get in there but we managed so our Taylor managed so thank you <laughs>
just had a Mickey pretzel, a little snack. We got on Mickey and Minnie's Runaway Railway, as y'all saw. Now, Tower of Terror, oh, I don't get on that anyways, but they do. It's been closed since about three something this afternoon when we got here, so Matt tries to say it's when they close that it, it's throw up, but I think it's a little more than throw up because it's uh, 6.30 and it is still closed. So, highly doubt it's throw up, but it's been closed, so they're gonna go on Rock and Roller Coaster. I think they're doing single rider so that it goes quicker because that one even has a long way too, even though it normally doesn't, but it's fine. So, we're gonna go sit in the gift shop. Fun, Justin fun. Is. Yeah, well, I am, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so instead of waiting in the gift shop for 10 hours while they're in line, I decided to do the Lightning McQueen Racing Academy. They're about to yell something. Uh, so, there's like trivia and stuff, and Lightning McQueen will be actually on that daily stage. Yes, I know, so crazy. Never done this before, clearly aimed for kids. But it's better than just sitting in a gift shop. This looks really cool. It's like. Almost night, kind of sort of doesn't really look like it, but it almost is. We've never been here at night. The lights look really neat. We're gonna go in some of these stores before we go into our Oga's reservation. Yeah, we're gonna look for Sabak, which is a game they play on the Star Cruiser. Hold up. Okay, I bought Sabak. I'll do a little reveal. <laughs> There's the Millennium Falcon back there later, whenever we do. Oh, here's, here's a, I guess this is Oga's. People say this building looks like Donald Duck because of the two eyes and the little thing and like that's his hat. But I got this glowing blue, blue like orb thing, I don't even know, but it looks cool. So let's just carry it around, it was like $21, but I had a gift card and I had my uh, annual pass order discount. So it took it down to like 17, so not too bad I think. So we're about to go into Oga's, I'll vlog in there. Well, I got that on my video, don't say that. I put my orbs in. This looks so cool. Mom, what drink did you get? Huh? What drink did you get? A wama. Warm white white wama. What's in it? White wama. It's a banana and fruity tasting ale. Ale beer. Right, what'd you get? Fuzzy tauntaun. It's supposed to make your tongue numb. She did not want to try that one. Matt, what did you get? White wama. Oh, same thing as her? Nice. It's very noisy in here, but it's cool. There's DJ Rex over there. Apparently he used to be on the Star Tours ride, I barely remember. But now he decided to take up DJing, apparently. So, I think this is really cool. I like the little tank up there that has like a, I don't even know what it is, some frog creature, I don't know. Cool. Okay, here's my blue Bantha drink. Taylor's getting a photo. It's really hard to see, like, it's blue, there's a cookie on top of it. It looks really good. And then Taylor's Fuzzy Tauntaun. Let's see how she... It's supposed to come in like a few seconds later. Is that making your tongue numb? <laughs> Where? <laughs> I'll sit mine now. Hold on. It's like blue milk. It's basically blue milk. Really? That's good. Okay, now I got the carbon freeze. Okay, thank you. Now I got the carbon freeze. I don't know what I expected. This is so cool. There's like little popping curls thing and it's smoking. I like it the smoke like that. Really, really cool. Taylor got a... What'd you get, Taylor? Vespian Fizz. Vespian Fizz. That's awesome. <laughs> oh, that is good. I don't know how to describe it. It's like apple. It's like a sour apple sort of thing. Our last thing. I don't know. This one was really, really good. It has dry ice on the bottom. I don't, know if I don't remember what I recorded. I haven't recorded. But uh, this was dry ice in the bottom, and that made it smoke and everything. It had little apple popping curls in there, and they were so good. So it, it was like green apple tasting. It wasn't very strong. It was kind of like if you've ever had a bubbly before, how like it's like sparkling, but it's not really there that much. Uh, so it was good though. Um, I really liked it. The popping curls were probably my favorite part. And then Taylor got, uh, I forgot what hers is called, but hers has like this like, we shine a light on, it's got this like glittery shimmer stuff in it. It's empty too, but uh, it had this like glitter looking thing in it. And they got more uh, beers, I believe. So we're gonna, yeah, Taylor got a fuzzy tauntaun. You already know, we already showed that. All right, we're leaving Oga's Cantina now. That was really, really good. I don't need to get a blue milk anymore because 
We just had drinks and I had a blue milk while I was in there. It was really good. When I bought this, I thought that it, oh yeah, this is where I think the Star Wars Galactic Star Cruiser people get let off. Really cool. Uh, sure. I first saw this, I thought that it was a blue milk, like, canister thing they had them back there. I thought that's what it was, but then I pushed in and realized that it lights, it lights up. Hold up. There it goes. So, pretty cool. I don't really know what the point of it is, but we're leaving Batu now. It's really empty, so if you're here at night, it's like 8.30. It's very empty, like, there's nobody here. So, um, Mom and Matt, they went to a couple other stores, it's like lights in the sky. Um, we, we're going to Toy Story Land and go get a Pop-Tart. One final hurrah before we go back to the Caribbean. Oh, it is lightning. We are about to be struck. Oh, it's sprinkling now, too. I just felt a drop. We're going to Toy Story Land. I'm okay. This should be fun. Yeah, let's grab these pop tracks and roll. Hold on. Um, we're going into Toy Story Land. We've never been here this late before. <clears throat> like, the whole park. Maybe in a very, very, very long time. It's not as far as I can remember. It looks really cool at night. I think this one's really kind of underrated to be at night. So, we're going to go pick up. Oh, I just got jumped on. Uh-oh. Y'all. It is literally torrential downpouring. I'm sure I'm really loud right now. I'm having to hold my phone. We have to take the bus. The gondola's not running because it's raining so much. Oh my god. Okay guys, I look rough. It's the next day now. Uh, so I really hope you enjoyed that video, part one of our four day adventure. I will be vlogging even more. Sorry I didn't vlog on many rides. We didn't get to ride many things. I rode two things. But you know how be. There's the Skyliner back there going across. So we're about to go to Epcot today, so look forward to that in the next video. So if you enjoyed this, please leave a like and subscribe if you haven't. Bye.